time on Patch Bros, everybody. This time on Patch Bros. Fuck. I know what I'm saying. Shit, did they tell me how many DK can find? No, I think they told you how many Diddy can find. Yeah. I didn't read it. I don't read quite that fast. I know they just told Diddy can find. But well, maybe. I'm wondering, like, if earlier they told me how many DK can No, fucking... Are the controls inversed in water? This is bullshit! Can you change that? Why does this make sense? It doesn't. It is a fast fucking swimmer. Also, I love that there's no air meter or monkeys. Oh, I just get 20 bombs? That's awesome. Well, I mean, with your gun, you started with 50 pellets. This is true. Hey! I don't have a gun. Nope, yeah, she needs to go get it. Yeah. Shit! <sighs> Something about Diddy reminds me of Mario. The voice. The head? The voice. Oh. What? Hey, dude. Hey! I had three, he needs three! Yeah, give me a foot. Yes, please. Kicking it. Why you gotta be kicking the mic, Thomas? I'm not trying to. Yeah, I know how to work a gun. Thank you. Goodbye. Get out of here. Thanks. Hopefully that last bubble wasn't something important. No, I'm pretty sure he always gives you like a tip, but I'm like, I don't give a shit. <laughs> Just, is there? Oh, I know what that is. What did he died way faster than the one that DK fought? Maybe Diddy Kong's amazing ballerina tail whipping powers are more impressive than Donkey Kong's um, aggressive sitting me. powers. Excuse you what? Why did I just fall? Because you walked up? But there's a vine. I jumped at the vine and I didn't. Mm -hmm. Oh, you know what time it is? What time is it? It's right outside. Oh boy. Uh, what's up here? That's right. What's up here? Go away, go away. Oh, Okay. Oh. What the hell was that? Your guess is as good as mine. Um. Oh boy, it's the rainy spot! Someone farted? That's my guess. <laughs> <laughs> the fact that you even laughed at that. Yeah, I got it. <gasps> they die just as easily as the little ones. Okay. Oh, I know. Here we go. Time to have some fun. Yeah. Oh, you can't get them when you're right now. This only has a limited time on it, right? I think so. God, could you imagine if it was unlimited? Jeez. You would never not be the... 
the rhino. Oh man, I can't do that. <laughs> hey, there's another entrance to the thing. What is this? It's a box of watermelon. Okay, time to go back into rhino mode. Yeah. <laughs> rhino mode! What was that sound? That you just made? Don't do that again. <laughs> Maybe I should add it to my special skills. Vaguely distressing growling noise. That's gotta really hurt his coccyx. Yep. <gasps> Banana! Can I leave that there? No idea. I'm gonna leave it there for now. Fucking beaver fix it up. Let's go kill the beaver to get it back. Yeah. I want my horns. Okay, here we go. Yay! How painful do you think it is for God? Serious? Fucking. How painful do you think it is for him to transform into a rhinoceros? Probably pretty bad. Yeah? I mean, I, maybe not though, because he gets bigger as a rhinoceros instead of smaller. Like, if he got smaller, I imagine it'd be really painful. If he got bigger... I... I need food. Getting bigger, I mean, he doesn't get... Does he get that much bigger? I, I mean, Dicky's a pretty big ape. So, I don't think he gets that... Much bigger, but I can imagine it's not the most comfortable thing he's ever done. Okay, so what about going from uh, this back into ape? Well, if you consider. Nope. Jesus Christ. If going from ape to rhino hurts, then I imagine that going from rhino back to ape would not hurt. I don't know. These are important questions. I feel like it'd be the other way around. Really? It wouldn't hurt to get extra stretched out, but it would hurt to return to no normal form? Maybe it'd hurt both ways. I don't know. Oh, that would suck if it hurt both ways. <laughs> That's what she said. Mm-hmm. Um, Where was the door that required the peanut pop gun? Was that that was up by? Yeah. There's also that like mountain up there that requires it. Yeah. And that's like a whole other area. Yeah. Oh, and there's the minecar like little mini game. Oh my gosh, the minecar mini game. I remember being like so frustrated by that. Yeah. Go, go, go. What nope. just happened? Don't tell me what just happened. I was gonna say, do you actually want to know what happened? Catherine? Yes? You know my nerves sometimes? Yep. Oh. My god. Um. I just broke it. Yep. Okay, okay. Okay. I remember that. Uh, that uh, saving, all you do is click it, he says okay, and it's saved. There is no, like, save time. Oh, oh, no, I'm good. I broke it. Okay. Except, what the fuck? <laughs> fuck you. Okay. What is that? 
it's just not going to work. Shoot me up. Clean me up, Sky! Have you seen that? Seen what? Um, there's this lady, I guess it's from like the 80s. She, uh, she wrote these songs that are absolutely ridiculous. Um, and they're just terrible. They're just bad songs. Mm, um, no, I don't think I... Oh, that's what we're doing between episodes. Oh boy! They're so bad. It's like a train wreck. Uh, good old Daniel Avidan is the one that, uh... Of course. Yeah, kind of, I guess, recommended them. Of because course. Because they're, they're so bad. You sound like a bad movie enthusiast describing a bad movie. Like, oh, it's so bad. Well, I mean, they're like, they're gloriously bad. Yeah. Hmm, I wonder if I'll need Cranky's help in here. I don't know. I don't know. No! Oh. Okay. Well. Oh, we need the the little the like charge thing to get up those cliffs. Oh, that's right. That's right. Well. Oh well, we'll figure out the charge thing next time on Patch Bros. Oh, some bombs. What's just that? 